Seven stages here at the Rally of Nations Wanawato. Max Osberg making his way out of the Otata stage. Let's go and see if we can grab a very quick word in the shade here with Max. Oh, Max, it was a great morning for you. Tell me how the second loop is looking. Yeah, it looks quite okay. I think on the first one we we beat Adrian by 18 seconds and the last one I don't know, but we had a good run there as well. So hopefully we extended the lead. How rough is it though? It's quite rough, but uh, I think it will be worse on the third pass. So we will uh, try to manage as good as possible. But uh, no, the, the stages are holding up quite well, to be honest. Staff, well done, Max. Thank you. So just to let you know, we're probably six kilometers from the stage end. It's great. We're in the middle of the countryside. The stage end, if you can have a look up there, if you can have a look up there, the stage end, in the hills these hills are quite incredible you wouldn't believe it but the height above sea level 2600 meters is the pass the top of the hill is higher than that that the cars come through here we go it's matthew wilson making his way towards us let's see if we can grab no it's not not matthew wilson at all it is adrian formo let's have a word with adrian adrian it was an encouraging morning for you how have the afternoon stages been yeah you know it's uh it's more sleepy than I would expect for the second pass. There is a lot of loose, so if you are a little bit out of the line, then you lose a bit the, the control. But uh, but yeah, it's uh, the stage is still really nice, so enjoyable. Did you have to make many changes to the car for this pass? Honestly, it starts to be quite rough, and uh, so yeah, there was some really bad loose work coming from the ground, and uh, I think we'll have to, to to make some protection for the car. No punctures? For yet? No. So so far, we behind. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> Dirt fish. Dirt fish. Yeah? And who is this? It's. Oh, it's uh, Ricardo. See? I think it's Ricardo, isn't it? Yeah, uh, Ricardo from GHR. <laughs> Ricardo, we met you the other day when you were testing. Yeah. How have things gone today, Ricardo? It's very dusty. Yeah, we were really, we were doing really good. We were third overall, but I just got a puncture, so I had to stop mid-stage and change it. Everything went wrong, so we took like four minutes to change it, so we lost a lot of time. But I think punctures could be a big feature. If you only pick up one puncture this weekend, you could still be in the mix. Yeah, I think it's a very long rally, and the conditions are really hard, so uh, this is you know, where we keep fighting, and let's see what happens. We saw you obviously doing a bit of uh, training with Mads Osberg the other day. Have you managed to put into practice some of the things you learned? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I mean, Mads is a great driver. He told me a few tips and I'm trying to do them as best as, as, as I can uh, without risking the car. So I'm getting better, I'm getting faster. So I think the coaching with Mads is, is good. <laughs> great job, Ricardo. Keep it together. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey, we're still in the countryside, we're still flagging down drivers. This one is Matthew Wilson. Let's have a word with Matthew. Uh, well, hang on, I'll get a stone. Get a little stone to put under the back wheel. Here we go, stone under the back wheel, just to make it feel like a proper stop line, like Matthew. Bro, you like a pro. You think I'd maybe done this once or twice before. <laughs> You've done these stages once or twice before. How are they looking after two passes? They're not actually as bad as I thought. The end of the uh, second one. It's getting quite rough. It's quite sandy and there's a lot of things digging out. So I'd imagine next time through that will be pretty uh, pretty bad. But the, the, the harder, bigger road, if you like, it's not it's not too bad. Car set up for this afternoon's conditions. Are you happy with your ride height and with the protection of the car? At the minute, I think we probably will go a little bit higher in service um, just to try and protect it, really. Um, but yeah, other than that, it seems it's okay. We're just, um, we're, just, we're just enjoying ourselves. You've got a little fan club here. They've been waiting for you all morning. <laughs> Hello, boys. <laughs> Good luck, well done, boys. Thank you. <laughs> I've got my little helpers. How good is this? <laughs> Benito! 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 Benito!
<laughs> Benny, you have a little fan club here. Uh, tell me, this afternoon stages, have they stood up well or is it a bit tricky in there? Yeah, we are doing much better. In this stage, we are second. Just uh, Matt Salzberg was in first, uh, us in second, and uh, Adrian in third. So I think things are going much better with with my car. The, the alignment is much better, the setup, and we need to push more. <laughs> Yeah, you know, it's always a difficult one though, isn't it? Because this isn't a rally for pushing from the start. You've got to balance everything because it does get so difficult. Yeah, the, the stages are getting longer with this kind of uh, weather. It's very warm in, in here uh, and the tires, the car is suffering. The, everything is getting getting warmer and, and it's very difficult to keep the pace all the stage. Good job so far, Benny. And listen, we saw Benny Sr. on the back of a truck. What happened to Benny Sr. this morning? Yeah, I think it was turbo problem. Uh, yeah, or or steering. I don't know. Yeah, we'll find out later on. Well done, boys. Keep it thank together. You, thank you very much. Come on, little lads. Let's let go. Check the back. Harry, we could hear a noise coming from your car. You're trailing something. What's happened? Uh, one uh, right corner going a little bit wide. There is some uh, big uh, rocks. Uh, I think first it's a puncture or something, but uh, I not feel any different. Is that Harry Rovenpera getting a little bit excited and pushing a little bit hard, maybe? <laughs> yes, I try pushing what I can, and uh, but it's... Uh, Interesting, I, I, I have to say. But the big question is, are you having fun yet? You were saying earlier on it was difficult to have fun. Are you having fun? Yeah, now I started learning a little bit that how I have to drive it, that car, and uh, that way is coming feeling and uh, getting better feeling and uh, kind of a little bit pushing and uh, like, like usually in the past. As always, well done, great job as well in the co-driver's seats. Lovely stuff, Harry Rovenpera.